hello, hello! I'm back playing another game from Steam, and this time it's Sumire. Or Sumire, not really sure, but the developers describe it as a magical narrative adventure about choices made, dreams lost, and found. So we're gonna make some choices and find some dreams. As you can see, this is the demo, but the game is out. I think it released last May. And the cool thing is your progress from the demo will transfer over to the full version, which is a feature I always love to see in indie games. But that's enough talking, no more squawking, new game. And obviously, if you've been here, you know me, you can probably guess why I chose this demo. I like the art style. <laughs> you know, what can I say? I like beautiful things. Oh. That dream again. C. I can't use space, but this time I heard her whispering in my ear. Oh, I can use space, okay. Grandma was trying to tell me something. Something I needed to hear. All right, well, get up, girl, and let's hear it. Okay, wasp. Now, normally I'd have my controller hooked up just in case, but I didn't get it yet for today's gaming session, so it is what it is. I like her little walking animation. No, oh, it's a little shrine. Every night, Mom leaves this on. There, no more sound of water. Okay, so I had to use C to interact, but I can still use space to advance the dialogue, which is nice. Hi, Grams. Sorry, I miss you and I love you. Okay. <laughs> Her little feet. Oh, listen to that. They actually change the sound of her footsteps according to the floor that she's on, which is nice. Okay. Ah. Starlight, star bright, first star I see tonight. Wish I may, wish I might not see my grandma in my dreams tonight. Because that shit is scary. <laughs> okay. What am I supposed to be doing? Shall I go to sleep? Because I feel like... Oh, no. See? See on anything? Oh! Okay, it did say that you can kind of wasp, so there is a little bit of depth. It's not just um, side-scrolling. I should visit my grandmother. She's in the room just past the kitchen. Okay, so that's what I was doing. And I don't need to use wasp. I can use the arrows, too, which is good, so I'll just do that. Oh, look at that. Hello. Yeah, I, that's where I'm going. Re yeah, okay, sweetie, relax. Wee. Okay. See. Grandma, sorry to bother you. I hope you can hear me in the other world. Since Dad left, Mom just sleeps all morning. She seems really sad. I clean every day, I do my homework, I do everything I can. But I feel so alone. I think he wanted to tell me something. Something that would make it all good again. Aww. I'm sorry. Don't worry. You have me. I'll support you. Please help me. Hmm. I could have actually done a voice for her, but you know what? I'm not going to. It's early in the morning. I haven't recorded in a very long time, and my voice sounds weird. <gasps> Grams, did you hear that? I better go see what happened. <laughs> okay, what a stoic face to make. Uh, all right. Was it that bird? That bird break in here? Oh, no. What is this? Oh, mom's going to be so upset. And what is this thing? A strange seed. What was that poem grandma told me? A seed from the sky, planted in the heart of spring. What dreams will grow? Very specific. That is a very specific poem. Oh, I do like how it's glowing. Also, where is your mother? Like, where is her room when... I see walls, the kitchen, <laughs> that other room, and then more walls. Who put that in here? Bird, I swear to God, you will pay for my damage. You know how expensive it is to replace a window, especially if it's like double paned? All right. Um, oh, thank you, game. 
I really do like the art style of this. Hold on, I just want to look around for a second game. Great sound design too. Also, I've I had my question answered. My mom is somewhere over here. Whoop, 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 whoop. Nice animations. Oh, there's Mama. Hello, Mama. Shh. Oh, I'm sorry. She does look depressed. She's like curled up in a fetal position. I mean, that can be comfortable to sleep in, but also it can be a response to <laughs> depression. So uh, I'm going to say that it's the latter since dad's gone. This looks like the place for you. Kepionk. I'm tired. <laughs> Sweetie, was that enough to tire you out? Good night, friend. I hope whatever you are, your life will be more beautiful than mine. That's so sad, sweetie. If I could rub your back, I would. Huh. Okay. Oh. I kind of don't like how that looks. Oh, okay, now it's... It's worse. <laughs> it's worse with the smiley face. It's giving me super Undertale vibes, but fine. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello. Shh. Are you hushing me? My mom's asleep. Where did you come from anyway? Besides the seed, obviously, that you put in there. I came from the seed. And the seed came from a magical place. You're worried, aren't you? Yes. I think I'm going back to my room. <laughs> no, you can't leave me here. I only have one. One? One day. One life. That's all I have to live in the beautiful human world. What do you mean? When the sun disappears from the sky, I must return to the place I came from. Exactly at sunset. So you have to help me. But why? <laughs> she, I don't know. Do you lack empathy? I might have to check your criteria, girl. You might be a sociopath. Because the human world is something I never experienced before. Well, I'm a human. Yes. And I'm going back to sleep. So that's my human experience. <laughs> oh, I like you. You're sassy. If you had one day to live, is that how you really want to spend it? I have to stay here. My mom needs me. But I need you too. And you've just met me and I'm a plant. So clearly I take precedence. We have to go outside. Oh, no, I can't do that. You can. I can't. You want to. I don't. You will. I won't. That's the spirit. Hmm. Please, don't just leave me here to die inside. I don't know. Walk out an eye, bro. What if you would get to see your grandmother again? Oh, all right. This you shouldn't trust. Whenever somebody is promising you that you can see a dead relative, the answer should immediately be no. Let this plant die. To know what she was trying to tell you. Really? You could do that? Pick me. Show me a wonderful day. And I think it will happen. I'm not sure, but <laughs> we'll find out together, won't we? Uh, you know what? Pick the flower. It's a demo. I'm always ready. Uh, C? Okay. Ouch! Shh! You did it! The deal is made. The day is waiting. And life will never be the same. Which isn't ominous to say at all. Also, who picks a flower by ripping its head <laughs> from its base? That's, again, something is not right about these two. Let's go. Wait. I need my notebook. It's in my backpack. Backpack, 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 backpack. Get it fast, then meet me outside. 
and don't forget to tell your mum you love her. Oh boy, 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 boy. Can I look at this again? What is happening to me? Yeah, that's exactly the right question to ask. Mom, I am going to tell you that I love you because this plant might murder me. Mama. Mom, wake up. Why won't you help me? Sumire? Uh, but I'll see you for lunch. Don't worry. I love you. Okay. Will it say the same thing? Shh. Okay. I like that when I can click on something again, but the dialogue doesn't just repeat. Anyway, what is this? There's some money in here. I won't take any. Yet. My God, why is everyone in here such creep? He promised he would call every day at lunch, but he never does. Oh, dad's gone is in gone. Like he left you guys. Maybe I misread that. Whoops. I like your, I like your little hoodie. Maybe you should buy one of mine. That's a merch plug. That's a thing that YouTubers do, right? But I'm not a YouTuber. I'm a small tuber. That's different. Yeah, get out of here, bird. You're the one who did this. Was that mask always sad looking? I picked this little flower from the yard to watch over my books. But maybe the flowers have been watching over me the whole time. Oh, maybe. I didn't even know I could just go up to random things. So that was the flower. It's my backpack. Let's get that. I never go anywhere without my backpack and notebook. If I can see Grandma again, maybe I can fix my family too. And then Dad might come home again. Maybe. Sweetie, you are so sad. This is exactly the opposite of what I needed to start my morning. My piggy bank. Sometimes it fills up with coins. Maybe another day? You mean sometimes it fills up with coins on its own? If so, I'd like that. <laughs> I would really love to have something that just replenishes its funds on its own. Oh man, I'd have my mortgage paid off in no time. My dad left some papers here, but not much else. He let me put my treasure box here too. Wait, there's a note here for my grandmother. I don't remember seeing this. It says, My dear Sumire, I have a coin. You can use it for anything you wish. But my real gift to you is to ask that you do a special favor for the stationary lady. That's very random. She's my friend, and if you help her, you can make her very happy. All right, I got me a coin. Can I put that in the piggy bank? Maybe tomorrow will be a better day. Okay. Interesting. What else does it say? Oh, okay. See, I praised you for not repeating, but you did it there. Anything else I can look at? I wasn't doing it before because I didn't realize I could walk up to stuff. Mom hasn't gone shopping for days. That's bad. There's still some purple... <laughs> I thought she was going to say, there's still some purple drink. Oh boy, there's still some purple cake in here for my birthday. I'll bring a piece in case I get hungry. Nice, I've got a coin and some cake. That's all you need, folks, is some food, money, and a backpack. -oo. There are only a few things left of Grandma after all those years. Here's her hand mirror. She checked herself every morning. She used to warn me that the face you show the world is the person you become. True that, Grams. Did she really mean it? She did if she was wise, and I think she was. Anything else are you going to repeat? Don't disappoint me. Yeah, you all right. All right, fine, 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 fine. All right, Grams, I'm out. I don't know what you're up to, Grandma, but I'm going to meet the flower outside. All right, goodbye. Love you. Love you. Also, since I can look at things. Let me just see if I could look at stuff that was over here, like this painting. Dad loves this photo. Oh, it's a photo. Excuse me. It's from their honeymoon before I was even born. I guess that was a better time. Oh, that was nice. That nice little tune. 
Here goes nothing! Bye, everyone. Look at the plant. Are you going outside with the flower you just met? Excuse me? Did you say something? Maybe I'm going crazy. Hmm. I don't trust the flower. Because even my plant that has been there supporting me for who knows how long was like, Are you gonna go? What's that guy? <laughs> you know, anyway. Hello. I forgot what voice I gave you. Who cares? It's cold out here. I should go back. But look at the sky. Hmm. It feels like life, doesn't it? I mean, it's pretty. Oh, it's beautiful. Yes. We will live our whole day under the sky. Now, what should we do first? I want to know what my grandmother was trying to tell me. I think if I knew, my life would be good again. There's a place that's very special to both of you, isn't there? Yes, the wisteria tree. That's where I saw her in the dream. But it's pretty far away. We have to go through the rice fields and cross the cold stream. <laughs> then you know what to do. Oh. Well, let me write it down. Write it down? I write everything down. I'm a weirdo. All right. Into my journal we go. So we're going to have a wonderful day? Mm-hmm. All right, scribbly scrap. Perfect day. And... A scribbledy screws go to the wisteria tree. There. It's not much of a list, but it's a start. I'm ready. Okay, but say goodbye to the cat first. Are you ready? I guess so. Then let's go, bitch! Okay, but what cat? Was it on the uh, thing? I'm your friend, and I'm going to do everything I can to protect you, I swear. Alright, well, I'm going to go and say bye to the cat, because I... Oh, wait, there was no cat. Wait, what? I didn't see a cat, but okay, fine. Let's go. Oh, here's the cat. Hello, kitty. Hello, Neko Neko Masmeko. Hey, cat. Hello. Oh, you really can talk. I said hello to you every day. Sorry. What are you doing out so early? I'm going to see my grandmother at the wisteria tree. I knew your grandmother. She used to sneak me bits of fish in the morning. I miss her a lot. Sometimes I just want to forget I knew her. Oh. Do you think it's okay to forget someone you love? Hmm. No, we have to remember, Cat. I think we have to remember no matter how much it hurts. At least, that's what I'm doing. Anyway, I don't have any bits of fish. Stop being greedy. Then maybe you can bring me my own flower. What do I get for it? I'll give you something. You'll see. But not just any flower. A flower that looks like a bell. That cat's pretty talkative today, bro. Many creatures knew your grandmother. Well, the cat wants a flower that looks like a bell. I'd better write it down so I don't forget. Alright. Scribbledy scrabbledy. The cat said she'll give me nibbledy nabbledy. Alright. Wonderful. Let's go. Bye, kitty. Do I, should I talk to you again? Got that flower yet? No. Okay. Nothing to say except demanding your own things. What is this? Flower, I see something here. You know how I feel about glowies I can't interact with. It's very suspicious. Oh, here we go. Here's something that looks like a flower. I really do like the art style of this. Here's a flower that looks like a bell. Perfect for the cat. Yeah, but it's not getting it right now. <laughs> okay, that cat can wait. On to adventure! You should talk to the cat first. Oh, fine. What about my grandma? Small things are sometimes the most important. Alright, fine. Are you trying to, like, teach me the value of life or something, flower? Don't do that. Don't try to mess with my brain. Oh, here we go. Chie told me ghosts lived under here, and I almost cried. <laughs> I've heard of scarier things. <laughs> Much scarier. Right. Somehow I feel like you're one of those scarier things. Wait a minute. 
Am I going to say something about this? I know I would. Nature lets it rain whenever it rains. But humans need a can that makes rain. I never thought about it much. What about just letting things happen? I wasn't paying attention. I think the flower who is the one who said that first part. If I let things just happen, you'd still be a seed on the floor. Touche, plant. Oof. <laughs> Can I go this way? Oh, no. Okay. All right, cat. Here's your flower. Bum ba dum ba da ba dum. How wonderful. Check. Boy. Here, you can have my bell. Thank you. How will it help? Well, it can help scare birds away. Why do I need to scare birds away? You'll see. And because you did me this favor, here's a couple of coins. They might come in handy. Thanks, Cat. You're the best. Are we ready? Let's do it. All right, let's do it, guys. Ba dum ba ba dum ba dum ba ba dum. Coins coming out of my head. La la la, gonna walk instead. Ba ba ba, but I'm depressed. What is this? I call this place the Rotten Garden. How sad. Since Grandma died, the flowers are growing wild. Mom doesn't care. And I don't know how to take care of them. Hmm. I do water them every day. Thank you for your service. You didn't smile when you said that. I didn't appreciate it. It's so cold out. What am I doing? Now, listen. There's a crow up ahead. Oh, a crow. What do we do? You have to get us to the other side. Me? But you said I have you to help. These crows would eat me for breakfast. Or elevenses. Really? Then let's go back. No, you need to go forward, and I will be right here, behind you. So close your eyes and just run, bitch, run! Woo! Ain't gonna get me, crows! Ba -ba -ba. Oh, okay. Well, that didn't do much, because you stopped me. Oh, look at that. He's so juicy. Don't be afraid. Little girl. Uh-oh. Go back. You don't belong in the world. But I'm going to the wisteria tree. Speak up. Um, I said I'm going to the wisteria tree. Okay. Start walking. When the crow sends its evil minions, you duck. Duck? Goose. Just go. Okay. Ha! -ha! You're not hurt. Keep going. Okay. Hey All right. Whish! I knew I should have stayed home. Grandma, move forward. Hey! Whoosh! I'm gonna get you, crow. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh no! Okay, hold on, purple girl. You win. You scared me. Throw a stone at the crow? No, let it go. Thank you. I'm just doing my job. Here's a coin for you. Don't tell the other crows. All right, I don't know. Fine. You see, when you're nice to people, you get money. <laughs> What's this crazy thing? It's a wheelbarrow. Not to be confused with a wheelbarrow, as pointed out in the quarry. The farmers use it to carry the rice from fields. Ah, so when a plant dies, it's carried home with love and honor. Uh, you can think of it like that, sure. Then we eat it. What's this? You don't scare me. I wasn't trying to. All right. I mean, yeah, that's a pretty weird thing to say to someone. You just walk up to them and you're like, you're not scary in the least. Hello, Samire. The Scarecrow can talk too. Hi, Mr. Scarecrow. How are you? 
The crow's angry today. Your grandmother left me some of her protective power. But the power's fading. The crows fill my head with terrible words and ideas. I think I've got suicidal ideation, which isn't a joke. I want to die. I, I See, like I said, it wasn't a joke. I know where this game is going. It's fucking dark. <laughs> well, I'm going to the wisteria tree. I'll tell my grandmother you need help. She's still around? She can help? I hope so. Will you promise to come back and help me? I don't think I can make it to lunchtime. I promise. Okay, please come back before lunch. Stay strong. I did a good deed. You didn't do it yet. Slow your sushi roll. All right, let's go. All right, so how am I supposed to know when it's going to be lunch? Because I definitely want to come back before that. I'm going to check that. I don't want to lie to my buddy. Also, am I recording? <laughs> I should have checked that. I, I am. Okay. I mean, I thought I was, but you never know. Anything over here? I really want to know what these glowies are, but the flower's not saying anything. Dun, 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 dun. Hello, Turtel. I'll be with you in a minute. All right. Matane. Where are we going again? To the wisteria tree. Oh, right. In the forest west of the cold stream. You said. Okay, yeah, but I want to see this thing. Oh, fine. Turtel, hello. 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 What are you doing? You. I see. Well, do you need help with anything? No. Okay. <laughs> cool. Is anything over here? Hello. I was about to call them calliopes, but that's not the other word for them. Nothing to say about them? They're pretty. Here's a shrine. My grandmother talked about the souls of stones. She said everything had life in it. Every tree and rock and flower. You think you own whatever land you land on. That earth is just a dead thing you can claim. But I know every rock and tree and creature and every tree and rock and flower has a life, has a spirit, has a name. I actually don't remember if those are the lyrics, uh, but I don't care. I will use any opportunity to invoke the Disney. Let's see. The cold stream. I haven't been here for a while. You seem nervous. I almost drowned here when I was four years old. After that, Grandma would carry me across. Well, you have to cross alone this time. I'll meet you on the other side. I got friends there. That's another Disney reference to the Princess and the Frog, which... I actually didn't care for, which was sad because it was the first black Disney princess and, well, she disappointed me. Anyway, but why? When you're ready, just close your eyes and walk across. But you can do it. Good luck. Mew. Flower? Ah, oh, man. Hello? All right, fine. I guess I'll look around. Hello? Hello. It's pretty nice of you to talk to a rock. Well, you seem a bit lonely, that's all. Yeah, but another thousand years or so, I think I'll make it to the river. That's your plan? Yeah. Any chance you can help? I think you're too heavy. Girl, if that rock is too heavy for you... Well, I mean, you are a child. But try hard, you'll make it someday. <laughs> I, you didn't even try. At least try to pick it up. My god. This child. All right. Let's look at this statue. It's very cute. Hey, this little guy looks cold. I am. But I endure. Please. Don't worry about me. Help the Jizo anyway. Yeah, 
Oh, but anyway, well, well, hmm, well, it depends. I would feel inclined to just ask again, you know, because sometimes people are like, nah, I'm fine, I don't need your help because they don't want to feel like a burden. So I would make it clear that, listen, it's no problem. I don't mind helping you in some way if you will accept my help. And if they say again, nah, really, it's fine, then I'm like, all right, I fuck you then. But I don't want to see you on Reddit or Twitter bitching about how nobody helps you when you're sitting outside in the cold. So I'm going to say, I want to help. Um, I could try and buy you a little coat or something. I don't need it. But if you see one, it sounds so wonderful. All right. Smibbledy floobledy, scoop dooba dum boobledy. I promised the scarecrow I'd come a swoobledy. And the stone Jizo needs a coat for his smoobily. All right. Oh, there's a map. Oh, how cute. I'm on my way to the tree. And here's my stuff. All right. This belt was a gift. I don't, I know. I don't need you looking in here. Oh, that's cute that she's looking inside of the backpack as I'm looking at that. Does she pull out a map when I look at the map? I didn't notice because I, oh, no. That would have been cool. Can she fast travel? <laughs> my house is where I spend most of my time, but not today. Okay, well, let's get rid of that. Let's go. I like this game. Oh God, I don't want to give you a voice. Oh, yes? I need to cross this stream. Well, the Crow Queen asked me to stand watch. The Crow Queen? Yes. She'd be here, but she hates the cold water. Why does she care about me? Crows are entrusted with keeping the world in proper order. She wants you to go home. But my flower already crossed. So? So I have to go on. Will you let me cross, or do we have a problem? You're not really a crow, after all. This is not your fight. Well, I am the guardian of the stream. But I also have my children to feed. So if you give me two coins, you may pass. Oh, I'm sorry, are you going to go to the store? Here. Hand me the coins. Thank you, you may pass. You can listen to the sound of the river as you go. All right. Thank you. Can't turn back now. Here goes. Nice. Move left to cross the street. Oh, okay. Cool. That was interesting. Hey, you made it. You look different. Your color is more colory. I'm a reflection of you today. Oh. Anyway, how will I get back across? Next time I'll carry you, okay? Try it sometime. What what do you mean? What what do you mean try it sometime? What is it like right now? Can I try it right now? Oh, snap! That was super dope, Flower. How come you couldn't do that before? You know what? I'm not going to ask. I guess it's because he's he's coming to life. You know, the more I help people, the more good I do. Oh, look at that. My aura is glorious and warm. This really is pretty, but again, glowies I can't interact with. There's the tree. Let's go over here first, though. You know that gamer instinct. Bing, boom, boom, boom. What is that, a toady? This guy will be here long after both of us are gone. Ding, da, da, ba, la, ba, la, 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 la. It is indeed. I think we've gone too far. The wisteria tree is a bit behind us. I know I was exploring, but can I keep going or are you going to keep stopping me? Um, ba, la, 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 la. Oh, okay, fine. Oh, you're very handsome. That's... Okay. Looking for a prince? No, I didn't mean that. I know, you're young and in love. Not really. Not yet. What are you planning, Flower? Don't be a groomer. Your grandmother blessed this entire forest. Did you know that? I'm starting to understand. 
She touched the branches and the earth. She filled the sky with birds and bugs. Bugs? Why, yes, I'd love a bug. If you can bring me a nice juicy fly, you may get something for your troubles, like a look at this sweet frog ass. I'll look around. Okay, I'll get you a nice juicy fly. Or something yummy like that, you know, I'm not picky. Nice and fresh. Fresh. Still buzzing if you can. Right. All right. Well, you know what to do. Scrap, scrabble a scrap. All right. Let's go look at this uh, little shrine here. What a cute little shrine. You mean the Hokora? It's for a smaller spirit, not the same god as the shrine. Is there a god for flowers? Hmm, I don't think so. Oh. But if there were, I'm sure many people would love them. Yeah. <laughs> this game is so adorable. Oh, hello, Piter. Piter, no piting, please. A spider. Come on, you're not one of those I'm afraid of spiders people, are you? Uh, I never thought about it. Were you talking to the frog? I saw you. A little bit. Was I saying all the stuff about your grandmother and the branches and so forth? Yes. Well, I can catch more flies than he can, even if your grandmother knew that. I'll even give you a fly for free. Oh, what do I have to do? Just come back in the afternoon. I'll set you right up. But you know frogs eat spiders too. Hey, no way! Take the spider. No! We were just kidding. <laughs> Ooh. Please come back later. I'll work hard. Alright. Have fun doing that, my friend. My friendo. Alright, well, looks like the earth is flat. They were right all along. Let's just go back. Ah, this tree is so pretty. Hello, beautiful tree. Oh, loading screen. This is the wisteria tree. It was my grandmother's favorite place. I can see why. This is the place I came from. And at the end of the day, I must return here. Oh, so you came from here? Did you know my grams? Your grandmother loved this tree and all the power it contained. Let's just say she left a little bit of her love and power here to bring me from another world. But where is she? You said I'd see her. Hmm. I thought we would see her, but I don't feel her spirit now. Then where is she? I'm not sure. To see the dead again is a special moment few people will ever experience. But you said you could do it. Please don't let me down. I need to know what she wanted to tell me. Is there another place that's important to her? Hmm. There's an old shrine nearby. She used to take me there to make wishes. Perfect, let's go wish for a wonderful day. And to see my grandmother again. You seem to be glossing over that a lot, Flower. I'm gonna start calling you Flowey. I used to be able to play the uh, guitar like that, self-taught. Can't anymore, because I haven't touched my guitar in years. And now it's like all the calluses I built up are gone, so it hurts bad. <laughs> hurts very bad trying to finger those strings. There it is. What a beautiful shrine. That's not the shrine, dummy. That's the Tori Gate. Don't you know anything about Japanese shit? We pass the gate and walk down the path. At each moment, we respect the gods that live there. Can you do that, Flower? My grandmother taught me all that. It doesn't sound like a place for flowers. It's a place for everyone. There are spirits there and a place to respect your ancestors. But I think the crows will try and stop us. Why? It's complicated. You'd better go inside first. I'll see you after you make your wish. What if I get in trouble? You can do it. Trust me. Hmm. I trusted you so far and you haven't done anything for me, but okay. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right, let's be respectful. Mwah. 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 
Try to kiss everything. Oh, I have to do the water thing here, but she's not doing it, but fine. There's something there. I better rinse my hands for- Oh, now you're gonna do it? Okay. Grandma said we always clean our hands before entering the shrine. Swishy, swishy, swishy. Okay. Kiss. Kiss. I don't remember your voice. Little girl, why are you here? Your grandmother's no longer in this world. So go home. You won't answer? Then prepare for my crow soldiers. Their eyes will astonish you. Really? Get to the shrine, but remain still when the soldiers watch. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Oh. Audio cue, got it. Your soldiers ain't so tough. It's a good thing it didn't send me all the way back. Stop there! You refuse to go back home? I want to go home, but I can't. I promised my flower a special day. Your flower doesn't belong in the world, and neither do you. Go back! I'm sorry, I just need to make a wish at the shrine. I can see your fear and trembling. Will you return home? I don't know. Then we will surely meet again, little human. I hope not. I don't like you very much, and also I don't like doing your voice. And kiss! Kiss. This is not a thing you need to do. I'm just doing it. Kiss. A kiss. Oh, there's a path here. The shortcut leads back. Oh, to the wisteria tree. Okay, good. But I need to make my wish first. All right, well, yeah, let's go. Let's make that wish, girl. There it is. The old shrine. This is the place to make a wish and thank the gods. I've never done it alone. My stomach is growling. That's not a good sign. I need to eat. <laughs> There's a certain sequence I have to do. All right. All right, and then you bow. Good. Three times, sweetie. Oh, you did that twice. Okay. Now I make my wish. Grandma, I know your spirit is still watching over me. And I know in your heart you want what is best for me and mom. You told me something in my dreams, but I couldn't hear you. Please come back and tell me what you wanted to say. And let it be a wonderful day for my flower, too. I know he only has one day to live in this beautiful human world. My wish is made. Oh, nice. Oh. Sumire. You've wished for a wonderful day. Yes. But what does that mean? I'm not sure. Then search your heart. Listen to the music of the shrine. And imagine what you want to do with me today. A day like none other. So that at the end of it all, you'd know you did your best. And left nothing unsaid, nothing undone. You know, it's weird because it kind of feels like that's what you should be doing because I'm not the one who has only a day to live or am I, Flower? Is there something you're trying to tell me? Are you going to myrtle me at the end of today? <laughs> Did you think of something? I guess so. Then let's go back to the wisteria tree and make a list. Okay. 
There's a shortcut right behind you. I know. I saw it. Anything else to say about the shrine? So quiet now. Maybe I should come back later. Okay. Let's take the path while my stomach is growling so badly that it's distracting. I wanted to stay at the shrine a bit longer. But this day is for both of us. It really seems like it's just for you, honestly. I see. So let's make this list together. One perfect day. All right, so we made it to the wisteria tree. Checkums. What else did you imagine? Well, I lost my best friend Chie, and now I'm all alone. You lost your best friend? Yes, it hurts a lot. Then we should talk to her. We have to settle things with Chie. All right. I want to see if you can make a new friend. You're kind of my friend, aren't you? <laughs> I wouldn't go that far, no. But I will vanish at the end of the day. Oh. I want to see how you can make a new friend in the human world. That can be tough. Write it down and we'll see if we can make it happen. All right, Cap'n. What else? You know, I want to heal my family. My dad is gone. My mom is so sad. I want to tell my mom how I feel. And my dad too, so we'll come home again. Hmm, tell mom plus dad my feelings. How about something just for you? Something to make your heart tingle like a Pringle. Well, I want love. Love? Someone special, just for me. Sweetie, how old are you? Who? Hmm, can I tell you later? I mean, because it's normal for little kids to start to have feelings, but I just want her to understand what she's asking for and to better understand what love is. Though maybe dealing with her mom and dad and, you know, making a new friend and all that stuff will help her parse her feelings out so she gets that this special person she finds just for her. It, at that age, that's really just a friend. Anyway, I feel there's somewhere else you want to go. Oh, I think there is. There was a beautiful place. It was the last good place my grandmother took me. If I could go there, maybe I could understand something important. You need to go there today. All right, visit the beautiful place, fine. How about one more thing so we can fill up the page? I want to know what love is. I also want to know what my grandmother was trying to tell me. I have been telling you that, Flower, this whole time. In the dream. I see. You promised. I did. And if you do all these things, I think you will see her again. Hmm, maybe all of these things are what my grandma was trying to tell me. Fine. It'd be quite a day if we do it all. That's a lot. We have a list, but how do we do all of this? Start at the beginning. Where is Chie? Sometimes she's in town. My grandmother had many friends there too, but I haven't been there since she died. Then let's go! Okay, it's west of the forest. Mmm, this is a situation where, uh, and, and this is important, like I mentioned in the beginning, the feature of having your progress from the demo carry over to the full version. I've said before that that is the only instance in which I don't mind longer demos. It's if the stuff that I already played through, sweetie, I am talking because the issue with having a very long demo, especially if that demo is really just the first part of a game, is that if you do decide you want to play the full version of the game, you have to go through all of that stuff again. And the longer it is, the less you'll be looking forward to having to replay it. So basically, if the progress is not gonna carry over from your demo into the full version of the game, your demo should be short and sweet and get to the point. But anyway, all of that popped into my head because the point is I think this is where the demo should end. Whatever, are we ready to go to town? Sure. I guess so, it's west of the shrine, but it's hard to get down there. Get as close as you can. All right, are you gonna push me? Don't push me. Oh wait, it's west of the shrine, so I can't go. <laughs> so that's why. I thought I could go back that way. Sorry, that was me being super mega stoops. Oh, and it was the end, good. See, this developer knows the deal. 
assuming it is a game that can convince you the first step to a whole something. All right, whatever. Oh, hey, here's her cutie. Ash Ketchum. I haven't been so deeply affected by a game as I have in... Okay. Yeah. Cool. And I do like the fact that, you know, it's going to obviously tackle adult themes, but, you know, through this more innocent childlike perspective, which is nice. I like the fact that it has a lot of different mechanics going on. None of them are too complex, you know, so they don't take away from the story or the experience. You just kind of flow through it, but it still keeps things fresh. You know, I like that. So that was Sumire or Sumire. I'm not really sure how her name is pronounced. And like I said, if you like this, the full game is already out. So feel free to show the dev some love by buying it. And if you want to show me some love, then you know what I'm going to say. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Support me on Patreon at the $1 tier or higher. And I'll be back very soon with something new.